everybody. I'm Dr. Walter Sims, host of The Motivation Zone here on Periscope. Uh, I am the Minister of Motivation and happy October number two. Amen. First, let's say we uh, send our prayers uh, out to the victims, the families of the victims of the uh, Las Vegas uh, shooting that occurred a few hours ago. Um prayers go up. Um, this is why I'm such a proponent of living life every day. You don't know when your last moment is going to be. Uh, what are we talking about this morning? We are signing people up for single, not satisfied. Last day. Last day. Come on, doc. Come on, Dr. Lady Fee. Last day. Single, not satisfied. And what does the subject, what does my header say today? Stop talking boss C. Start acting boss C. There are certain things bosses do. Hey, Miss Annie. There are certain things bosses do. Hey, Miss Vanessa. Hey, Wilma. Hey, everybody. Good morning. Hey, Matthew. If I haven't said hey, my followership will make sure you get a good morning. But good morning, everybody. Listen, listen. Yes, yes. Thank you, Wilma. Listen, don't be the girl who needs a man. Stop. Be the girl a man needs. Y'all better help me this morning. You better help me this morning. We love confidence. I'll talk about that in the morning. We love confident women. Look at confident women. And, and they got it going on. Amen. Listen, ladies. And it, the reason I gear everything toward the ladies because you see who show up. For every 50 women I have, I may have one man. So I have to talk to the ladies. I got some for the fellas too, but the men are just not showing up. Yes, be a blessing to us. We need y'all. Keep your heels, head, and standards high. I cannot stress that enough. Keep your heels, your head, and your standards high. Hello, you are a Bentley. You are the Rolls Royce, you're a Jaguar, you're a Tesla. Keep your standards high. You guys are the thermostat. Hello, hey, seas of deliverance. Y'all are the thermostat, y'all the brick houses. Y'all are the prize. I tell my young ladies, y'all are the prize. Come on, somebody. Quote of the day, a diamond is still a diamond if it's appreciated or not. Come on, Dr. Lady Faye, come on. Just because someone else doesn't appreciate you doesn't take away from your value. Just because you are not appreciated doesn't take away from your value. I need y'all to screenshot that. I need you to screenshot it. Yes, yes. Help me preach, doc. Yes. You are a diamond. If I had a 14 karat diamond this morning, and if you didn't want it, it's still a 14 karat diamond. Do you feel me? So what a real relationship boss moves. You hear a lot of ladies talking about, I'm a boss, I'm a boss, I'm boss -y. No, and that's not getting you anywhere. I'm boss -y. That's not getting you anywhere. You want to know some real relationship boss moves? You want to know some real boss moves? Get your notebook out. Where's your notebook? Where's your notebook? Where's your notebook? Get your notebook. Where's your notebook? Yes. Yes. That's right. Yes. There you go. Come on, Wilma. That's exactly right, Wilma. Wilma, you off the chain. You already know. So number one, real boss move. Number one, love yourself. Ladies, I cannot stress this enough. You have to love Y-O-U. I cannot stress this enough. You have to love you. Number two. That's good. That's good, Wilma. Number two, have high standards. Because I have another quote. When you settle for less than... You cannot get frustrated with less than for being less than. No shade to less than. Because your less than is somebody else's high standard. Do you feel me? But you can't get mad 
at a less than for being less than if it's less than because it's less than. Do you feel me? Do you remember when we used to buy knockoffs like the Dooney and Burke, the coaches, the knockoff purses? You remember when that was a hot thing? I got a I got a coach bag for for fifty dollars. It's the real thing, and the handle broke. You couldn't go back to the corner to where you bought that knockoff. Yes, you can't get mad. You can't get mad when the handle breaks. You don't get a warranty with the knockoff. Oh, come on, somebody. That's why my wife will save her money, save up her money to get the real thing because it's, it's high quality. Hello, you got to have a high standard. If you want something here, don't settle for something down here and no shade down here. If you want to stay at a high-end hotel don't go to Motel 6 and get mad when your pillows are not fluffed and there's no mint on the pillow. Thank you. Thank you. Quality. And if you want a quality man, you got to be a quality woman and have a high standard. Yes. Yes. Come on, somebody. And number three, work on yourself. Personal development. Get a real coach, someone who's going to help you on your stuff. You don't need a coach that's going to help echo the same BS you tell yourself and they validating the BS. You don't need male bashing or women bashing. You need somebody that's going to bash that bad attitude. Come on, somebody. You need somebody that's going to help you look in the mirror and say, listen, that's your ish. Come on, somebody. You got to own your stuff. That's my stuff. Let me Give me hashtag, that's my stuff. Give me hashtag, that's my stuff. Give me hashtag, that's my stuff. That's my baggage. That's my bad attitude. That's my disposition. That's my stuckness. It's mine. Take ownership. Because when you own it, you will clean it up. You are expecting somebody else to love you and you don't love yourself. You don't want to take the responsibility to love Y-O-U. Well, get a real coach, not somebody that just want to take your money. You spent money, you wasted money on people and you still in the same shape. I'm the real deal. I'm high end. I'm a high end coach. Come on, somebody. Come on, somebody. Get a real coach. Hello, somebody. Number four, be open. Not like this. You got to get here. That's a lot of work. Going from here to here, you got to be open. What did Ruth say? This is what we're going to talk about in class. What did Ruth say? Ruth said she put herself in an open, vulnerable position. She told Naomi, wherever you go, I'm going. Whoever your people are, they'll be my people. She set herself up for rejection. Whoever your God is, he's my God. She set herself up for rejection. Thank you. She set herself up to be rejected. Naomi could have said, heck to the no. No, you stay here. I don't want to be bothered with you. But Ruth set herself up to be rejected. See, ladies, you're too comfortable. I'm looking at you in the eyeball. You're too comfortable. You claim you're a boss, but see, bosses make moves. You got to be open and you got to be confident. Men love confident women and women love confident men. I ooze confidence. Why are people attracted to me? I'm confident. You cannot tell me I'm not the stuff. You can't tell me I'm not the bomb.com. You can't tell me that. Call it arrogance if you want to. I just know what God has done for me. I know what God has taken me. I know what I've been through. You can't tell me I'm not the stuff. Come on, somebody. Come on, somebody. Come on, somebody. You got to be confident. When Naomi told Ruth what to do 
to attract Boaz's attention. She did what she was told. She laid at his feet and put herself in a vulnerable position. What woman in here, what woman in here has laid herself at a man's feet? And looked him in the eyes and say, here I am. Oh, come on, somebody. See, y'all, y'all want to run around and tell folks what you ain't going to do. And that's why you're still single. Walk around with your attitude, walk around, snapping your finger, talking about, I, I can do all this by myself. And that's why you're by yourself. And you the same woman, I talked about Friday, got your Harkin Dodge, you got your Zen, white Zenfidel, you got your pillar, and Netflix and chill by yourself. And that's, ladies and gentlemen, the rest of the story. You telling your girlfriend, and y'all go out in packs, and that's why you ain't got nobody, because y'all walk around in packs, barking and woofing like you a man, and you ain't no man. A man ceiling fan, okay. Okay, see that's why you don't, people don't want the truth. The truth is your attitude is getting you exactly what you want. You want to be by yourself and claim on Facebook you want to be in a relationship. Uh-uh. No, no, not for real. That ain't what you want. You want to be by yourself and that's exactly what you got. Because you're not going through the process. You're not going through the steps. Well, Dr. Sam, it's God's will for me to be alone. No, it's not and you got attitude about it. Why you got attitude? If that's God's will, why you got an attitude? Because my Bible tells me his commandments are not grievous. If he's commanded you to be alone, why did he say, A, it's not good for man to be alone, and he didn't tell you to be alone? Okay, okay, there you go. I'm, I, I, I'm not trying to be your friend. I'm trying to get you delivered. I'm trying to get you unstuck. I'm not your friend. And I'm a high-end coach. I am not your friend. I'm not here to be nice. I'm not here. I'm your cheerleader. Are you hear women talk all these Instagram per, per, posts? I'm a queen. You cannot be a queen without a king. And Proverbs 31 is talking about a married woman, not a single lady. Okay. Okay. You cannot be a Proverbs 31 woman and, and, and be single. Proverbs 18 said, he that finds a wife finds a good thing. You are not a girlfriend. You are not a bae. You are not a boo-boo. You are wife. Wife prep. What are you doing to prep to be a wife? I hope you know how to cook. I hope you know how to keep house. I hope you know how to manage finances. I hope you know how to give back rubs and massages. I hope, oh. Wife prep. That's the class you ought to be taking. Wife prep. Come on, somebody. Wife prep. Wife prep. Come on, somebody. You feel me? Thought for the day. Don't be the girl who needs a man. Be the girl a man needs. We need y'all. Y'all know we need y'all. We out here, we out here floundering around. Adam needs his rib. We need y'all. Keep your heels, head, and standards high. Ladies, y'all the thermostat. Start telling us no. A diamond is still a diamond if it's appreciated or not. Come on, somebody. What a real relationship boss move. Quit talking about it. Well, I, I'm, I, he ain't showing up. I, I'm not talking. I can't talk to him. I'm, I'm helping y'all get ready because Adam ain't showing up in my scopes. <laughs> I may have one man for every hundred women. I can't deal with a man. I can't teach a man if he don't show up. But I can talk to y'all. I can get y'all head and heart right. Don't worry about where Adam is. Because God brought her to Adam. His location was irrelevant. Come on, little mama. His location was irrelevant. See, get your mind, get your mind right. Ruth, and we're going to talk about this in class, Ruth didn't pray for Boaz. Ruth was not looking for Boaz. She told Naomi, wherever you go, I'm going. You got to be open to be moved. Adam, you were brought to Adam. Adam wasn't brought to you. Come on, somebody. 
you were brought to Adam. So you just be open. That's why number four said be open. You be led by the spirit as you do what God has called you to do. Thank you. We're going to teach all that in class. Love yourself. Yes. Love yourself. Have high standards. We're going to break down roof like you've never heard before. Love yourself. Have you really mastered loving yourself? Well, now you ain't putting up with no more BS. Have you mastered loving yourself? Have you mastered having high standards? I'm not putting up with that. Time somebody go, time somebody go left on you. Bye. All those red flags you ignore, uh-uh, no, we're not doing that. Work on yourself. Get a real coach. Ding, 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 ding. Somebody gonna who, who's going to help you on your stuff. We're not having pity party. We ain't getting on the phone crying together. You are not to cry with your coach. We ain't crying together. Orpah cried and didn't change. Ray, Naomi didn't share one tear and moved, okay? I'm just getting real. It's time for you to get out of your emotions. Get out of your feelings and let's do some work, some real work. You've got some hurts, some unresolved issues. Let's deal with that. Time out for crying. You done cried a river of tears. Cry me a river. You done cried enough. It's time to quit crying. Thank you. No, 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 no. You step up. Women, step up. Step up. Make us step up. Talk to the man he can be. Talk to the woman you can be. My wife told my son, do the best you can. Did we tell him to make all A's? Do the best you can. We set the bar high. Do the best you can. Okay. I'm tired of folks BSing. Because I know one thing for sure after 51 years. When you want to, you'll find a way. When you don't want to, you'll find an excuse. Y'all playing. Folks playing. You're not serious. When you serious, you'll get serious. Folks ain't. Folks playing. Y'all playing. You don't want to be with nobody. And okay. So those of I, I got a little bit of backlash when I said single women can't coach single women. I got some backlash. Are these single coaches teaching you unconditional love? And how you got to forgive yourself for accepting those exes? We See, if that single coach is not teaching you unconditional love, you'll never get there. Because to love like we need y'all to love, it has to be unconditional. We don't understand unconditional love. That's not being taught. I know that which of I speak. Folks not teaching on that level. Folks not teaching on that level. You got to be open. You can't be like this. How can you go in a relationship talking about, I'm just going to love you 50% and I'm going to keep 50% for myself. That's counterproductive. You got to be all in. And you got to be confident. Doc Sims, where we going? You got to get in singlenotsatisfied.com. I got four people in there already. I got six more spots. This shut down at midnight. It's shutting down at midnight. I'm so excited. I got four women that are tired of where they are, ready to take their life to another level. Are you ready to love again? Do you need help with this thing called love? Does your heart need some love rehab? You don't hear people talking like that. Are you ready to meet the man of your dreams? Join me for single not satisfied. You don't hear people talking like that. You don't hear people talking like that. This is real, y'all. I'm so excited right now. I don't play. I don't play. I don't play. Any questions? I don't play. I do not play. Any questions? I don't play. This is the quote of the day. A diamond is still a diamond if it's appreciated or not. Any questions? We don't play. It's time out for playing. Life is short. Life is real short. Look at the incident in Vegas. Who at a Jake Owens concert out in the open by Mandalay Bay? Who would have thought last night, early this morning, yesterday would have been their last day? You can't live in fear that you are going to get hurt. You can't live in that kind of fear. 
Don't be the girl who needs a man. Be the girl a man needs. We need y'all. I'm telling you. Keep your heels, head, and standards high. Bye, dog. Bye. I can't that I don't need my my king can't be intimidated by a queen. And I tell the men, extraordinary man, a man, a real man loves the fact that he has that woman. You don't hear me. My baby bad. Look at girl. See, he's got some insecurities. He needs me too. What? What? Man, a real man, a king. I want a strong team. You don't hear me. What? You better go sit down somewhere. Talking about I'm intimidated by your career. Bye, boo boo. Bye. I don't need, I don't need to no, I'm not lowering my standard. You've done that enough. You already know the answer, dog. You've done that enough. I dim my light so you can shine. The devil is a lie. And then you're gonna get frustrated at him when he can't lead you. Amen, ceiling fan. You don't have to, for nobody. You don't have to do that for nobody. Then he can't even make love to you right. You get frustrated in the bed. He can't even do right in the bedroom. That's a whole nother conversation. <laughs> 50 shades. No, he can't even act right. You all mad. You mad intellectually, you're mad emotionally, you're mad mentally, you're mad spiritually, and then you're definitely mad physically. Come on, somebody. Come on, somebody. Come on, somebody. I read a I read an Instagram post yesterday. You want a man that can make it climax without even touching you. I'll talk more about that tonight. You want a man, women, you want a man that that touches you so deep in your spirit. It just. Yes. Well, you got to be patient. You got. That's another conversation. That's another conversation. And if you're there with him then you got to speak to the man he can be. That's your job as our support. Come on, Miss Vanessa. You feel what I'm saying? That's another conversation. But we got to deal with the single mentality right now of our ladies. And if that's another conversation I'll deal with a little bit later. But for right now, y'all need to be in single, not satisfied. What a real relationship ball move. Am I making sense? Give me a one if I'm making sense. Give me a one if this makes sense today. Give me a one if this makes sense. Give me a one if, I feel good this morning, y'all. Thank you, Lily. Lily, you need to sign up for this class. Doc, coach, doctor, y'all need to be in this class. Or gift it to somebody that you know need to class. We going in, we pulling some layers back. Because our baby girls, our ladies need help. Our girls need help. Our women need help. And I have a gift with women. I can talk y'all talk. I can talk you talk. I got 26 years in the game. I'm not perfect, but I, I kind of know how to get you there. I know how to get you there. I need y'all to go ahead and sign up. This class, this this seminar going to be off the chain. I taught love rehab, but this is love rehab 2.2 because you're single, not satisfied because you're not satisfied with yourself. That's where the biggest work needs to be done. And once you open up, come on, somebody. When you start loving you, life will open up for you. Your attitude will get better. Because some of y'all in here got a bad attitude. Can, can, we, can we be transparent? Can we be transparent for a moment? Who in here has a real bad attitude and needs some adjustment? Give me a five if you really need help with your attitude. You really need to be in this class. Give me a five. Give me a five if you got an attitude this morning. And just be real. We're family. We, this ain't no shame. We, it's no shame in here. There's no shame in admitting you need help. The only shame is not asking for help. Give me a five if you got an attitude this morning. Give me a five if you got an attitude. Or give me a five if you know somebody with an attitude <laughs> that need to be in this class. Give me a five if you got an attitude. Women, y'all are the thermostat. I know. <laughs> Come on, Miss Vanessa. 
Help me. Come on, Miss Vanessa. <laughs> Come on, Miss Vanessa. When you start loving you, life will open up for you. Your attitude will get better. Women, y'all are the thermostat. And I'm going to tell you what a lot of uh, a lot of married people did. There you go, Annie. You know what a lot of married people did, a lot of women did, a lot of men? When we got married, we married where we were and not where we were going. And now you look back 5, 10, 15, 20 years and you like, you are at a place and this person is at a place and you like, if I knew then what I know now, well, that's another conversation. But you need to be real thoughtful now. I, I got you, Annie. You, 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 you still, you got some stuff to deal with. You got some unresolved issues. You got some URIs. You got some unresolved issues. And when we get off this broadcast, I need you to go sign up for Single Not Satisfied. All right? You need to do it right now. Single Not Satisfied. Are you ready to love again? Do you need help with this thing called love? Does your heart need some love rehab? Didn't we have a good time in this class, Wilma? Thank you for the hearts, guys. Are you ready to meet the man of your dreams? You got to get ready. Join me for Single Not Satisfied. Amen. Oh, that, that was a good video right there. And I'm going to upload this one to you. Are y'all ready for Single Not Satisfied? Go to that website. Single Not Satisfied. All right. All right. <laughs>